I, I always recommend temperature sensors. People like to skimp out on those, but those are definitely a plus to have because if you can monitor the differential on your air conditioner, you can know if your air conditioner is failing before it fails, which is kind of what you want because I've always hated getting those calls of, hey, it's 130 degrees in the transmitter building and the transmitter is at 8% power. Well, why? You know, if you were, if you monitored the differential and you saw the differential drop from 30 degrees to six, oh, hey, we probably ought to do something about that. So there's a lot of that that, that goes into it. Just things that you don't think of, uh, uh, you know, electrical monitoring and stuff like that. Again, these are things that don't cost that much to monitor. You know, you can monitor three phase electrical service with three outlets wired across, one across each phase and then wall warts plugged into to metering channels from your remote control and you can monitor all three phases. You don't have to spend, you know, $1,500 on, on monitors for that. There's all kinds of, you know, cheap, effective ways to monitor the things that you're looking to monitor. 